Hello friends, welcome to my channel Geeks and Geeks. In this session, I am going to discuss another 10 important computer science journals related to Scopus as well as Web of Science Index journals. Okay, so in my last session, I discussed already about the first 10 indexed journals in Scopus and Web of Science. So this session is going to give you another 10 important journals related to the computer science. So let us explore our first journal on Applied Science and engineering progress so this journal publishes four issues per year that is it is a quarterly journal the issn number of this journal is 2673-0421 the scope of this journal includes applied science and engineering the impact factor of this journal is 1.86 as of 2021 it is having a h index of 7 with the quartile 4 this journal is indexed in scopus and the publisher of this journal is KMUTNB. The review processing time for this journal will be around two months, but within the, uh, the first decision will be intimated to the uh, user within first uh, nine to 10 days by the editor. Okay. So after the acceptance of the articles, it will take another three to four months for, for the publication. This is absolutely a free publication. You need not to pay any charges for submission as well as article processing and the link of the journal is given below so let me take you to the second journal that's journal of engineering science and technology review so this journal publishes six issues per year it is a bi-monthly journal the ISSN number of this journal is 1791-2377 and the scope of this journal is related to the engineering sciences. The impact factor of this journal is 0.698 as on 2021 and the H index is 31 with the quartile 3. This journal is indexed in Scopus indexed and the publisher of this journal is Kavala Institute of Technology. It takes around 2-3 to three months for the review process and after your paper is accepted it will take another one two two months for publication this journal is also a free journal you need not to pay any uh, cost for submission as well as article processing okay so the journal link is shared below so let me take you to the the third journal which is on journal of current science and technology this journal uh, publishes three issues per year and the ISSN number is 2630-0656. This is a multidisciplinary uh, journal which publishes the paper uh, in the scope of uh, engineering science as well as health sciences. The impact factor of this journal is 0.395 as of 2021, which having with the H index of 3 and it's a quartile 4 journal. This journal is indexed in Scopus and the publisher of this journal is Rangsit University. It takes approximately three to four months for the review and after your uh, paper is accepted it will take another two to three months for publication okay this journal is also a free journal and the journal link is shared below there so let us move further to the uh, fourth journal that is serenary journal of science and technology it's a very good journal this journal issues six issues per uh, year and it's a bi-monthly journal the ISSN number of this journal is 2587-0009 and the scope of this journal is advances in uh, engineering science agricultural technology medicine and public health as well as some related technology impact factor of this journal is 0.35 as on 2022 the h index of this journal is 4 and the quartile is q4 this journal is indexed in scopus as well as esei web of science and the publisher of this journal is Suranari University of Technology and the review processing time it will take around two to three months from the day of uh, submission and it will take another three to four months to publish your paper from the date of acceptance okay this is again a free journal and the journal link is shared below there and next journal we are going to focus on International Journal on Advanced Science engineering and information technology this journal publishes six issues per year it's a bi-monthly journal issn is 2460-6952 the scope of this journal includes in the area of uh, general science engineering as well as 
computer science the impact factor of this journal is 1.059 as of 2022 h index is 25 with a quartile 3 this journal is indexed in scopus and the publisher of this journal is insight indonesian society for knowledge and human development the acceptance rate of this journal is around 14.2 percent and it will take around uh, three to four months for the review process and approximately after four months from the acceptance it is going to publish your paper this is not a free journal guys uh, this will incur some cost around uh, uh, 255 us dollars and the journal link is shared below there and the next journal which we are going to focus is on international journal of applied science and engineering this journal publishes six issues per year that it is a bi-monthly journal and the ISSN of this journal is 1727-7841. This is a multidisciplinary journal. The scope of this journal include in the area of computer science, civil, electrical, electronics, biochemical, environmental, mechanical, as well as industrial sciences. The impact factor of this journal is 1.41 as of 2022 with H index of 7 and the quartile 3. This journal is indexed in Scopus and the publisher of this journal is Chayong University of Technology. It will take around three to four months to uh, for the review process and after the article is accepted it will take another two to three months to publish your paper this is not a free journal it will incur some cost to publish your paper that is 200 us dollars which will come around 15,000 in indian rupees and the journal link is shared below there So the next journal is on engineering science and technology and international journal just tech this is a very good journal guys because it uh, you can see the number of issues it publishes around six issues per year it's a bi-monthly journal the ISSN number of this journal is 2215-0986 scope of this journal includes in the area of engineering and applied sciences and you can see that the impact factor of this journal is 5.155 as of 2022 with the H index of 62 and this is a quartile one journal this is a very good journal because it you can see the indexing of the journal also this is indexed in scopus as well as science citation index expanded web of science and the publisher of this journal is elsewhere the only thing is it accepts only three percent that means out of 100 papers only three papers three to four papers will be accepted but the time for the first decision by the editor is around two to 2.5 weeks 2.5 weeks okay and it will take around uh, two to three months uh, from the day uh, uh, for the review process so if you feel that if, uh, if your article is having some uh, novelty okay then if your article is good uh, is of good quality then definitely you can prefer this journal for submitting your article okay so after your uh, the review process it will take another two months of time uh, two to three months of time to publish your paper so this is not a, a free uh, journal it will incur some cost for the full length articles and reviews it will charge you around 1100 us dollars and for the short articles it will charge you around 550 us dollars and the journal link is shared below so let me take you to the next journal that is on journal of information and communication technology this is again a very good journal because this is a multidisciplinary journal and you can see the number of issues is four issues per year that is a, it's a quarterly journal the, the ISSN number of this journal is 2180-3862 and the scope of this journal includes in the area of computer system organization hardware network theory network theory of computation security and privacy applied computing and many more the impact factor of this journal is 1.51 with h index of 12 and it is a quartile 3 journal this journal is indexed in both Scopus as well as ESCI Web of Science. The publisher of this journal is University Uttara Malaysia Press. And it will take around three to four months for the review process. And after your article is accepted by the journal, then it will take another two to three months to publish your paper. This is absolutely free journal guys. And the journal link is shared below. So let us explore the next journal that's on International Journal of Modern Education and computer science ijmecs this is also a very good journal you can see the number of issues is six issues per year it's a bi-monthly journal that means within two months of time your paper may get published ISSN number of this journal is 2075-017x 
the scope of this journal includes in the area of computer education it in education information security and ai the h index of the journal is 4 with the quartile 2 this is scopus index journal and the publisher is modern education and computer science press it will take around two to three months to review process and it will take another two to three months from the date of acceptance to publish your paper this is absolutely a free journal and the journal link you can see it below the last journal what i'm going to focus today is on songla nakarin journal of science and technology the number of issues of this journal is six issues that is it's a bi-monthly journal the ISSN number of the journal is 0125-3395. The scope of this journal includes in the area of agricultural and biological sciences, biotechnology, agro-industry, engineering and industrial research, and physical science and mathematics. The H index of this journal is 36 with a quartile 3. This journal is indexed in Scopus. The publisher of this journal is Prince of Songkla University. And uh, it will take around 3 to 4 months for the review process and uh, after your paper is accepted it will take another two to three months or three to four months to publish your paper this journal is also absolutely a free journal and the journal link is shared below there so thank you for watching guys uh, please do subscribe my channel for more updates so in the two videos i had given you around 20 uh, list of journals which is uh, indexed in both the scopus as well as web of science so please uh, re-verify the ISSN number in the scopus.com before you submit your article for the journal. As you all aware that Scopus database is going to uh, update their database every six months. Okay, two times a year. So in the month of June, July and in the month of November, December. Okay, so uh, whatever the ISSN number, I had shared it in the uh, the, in this session, please do verify it in the scopus.com before you submit your article. Okay, so thank you so much for watching guys. If you have any queries related to the journals, please do uh, drop a comment in the comment section below. Thank you so much. And the link of all these journals will be shared in the description. Thank you so much guys.